Meanwhile, U.S. President Donald Trump's pick to head the country's trade representative office has singled out South Korea for enjoying trade surpluses with the United States. During his Senate confirmation hearing this week, Robert Lighthizer said the trade deficit that Washington has with Seoul is massive and continual. Mexico was also named alongside South Korea. On the other hand, Lighthizer cited Australia, Canada, and Singapore as countries that the United States is recording surpluses. On a related note, the Wall Street Journal reported Wednesday that the free trade deal between Seoul and Washington is in peril. It cited the nominee's remarks, saying there are growing concerns the Trump administration will renegotiate or scrap the trade deal.